Hey, 49ers fans! Our team is ignited with thrilling updates that have paved the way for collective excitement. Some fans express reservations, finding it challenging to absorb the unfolding narrative. Hit subscribe to cast your vote of support for the 49ers and join us in unraveling the nuanced layers of this groundbreaking news. San Francisco 49ers linebacker Fred Warner is growing weary of losing Super Bowls. The star defender was in his second season when the 49ers lost to the Kansas City Chiefs in the Super Bowl in February 2020. He was also a key part of the San Francisco team that fell to the Chiefs again in the Super Bowl this past winter. Both losses hurt deeply. Yeah, not fully over it for sure. That one is going to sting for a long time. I'm not even over the first one, Warner said during an appearance on NFL Network. So I'm sure this last one was like three months ago? I'm still not over it. Those things stay with you. In this league, you earn scars throughout the league. You face adversity losing a Super Bowl, and of course as big as adversity that you could hit, and it stays with you. Each of the two losses was heartbreaking. The Niners squandered 10-point leads against the Chiefs both times, and in the most recent defeat, the 49ers fell in overtime. However, Warner is trying to turn the losses into a source of strength. It makes you stronger. It makes you better, Warner said. I know I'll be better from it. I've watched it several times and seen different plays we could have made to win that game. You just gotta be better next time. It's not a matter of if in my mind, it's a matter of when, when we do go win one. Warner is coming off a fantastic 2023 season in which he accumulated 132 tackles, 2.5 sacks, four interceptions, four forced fumbles, and 11 passes defended, leading to a Pro Bowl appearance and a first team all pro selection. The 27-year-old who played college football at BYU was selected by San Francisco in the third round of the 2018 NFL Draft. He has already made three Pro Bowl appearances and earned first-team All-Pro honors twice. The Niners are considered favorites to represent the NFC in the Super Bowl once again heading into next season and have actually been labeled as championship favorites by the odds makers. Still, at this moment, the Chiefs are clearly the team to beat, having won back-to-back -back titles. We'll see if Fred Warner and the 49ers can get another shot at them next February.